<laughs> Hello, the other day on YouTube, um, I think it was, uh, funny enough, it was A Time to Live. I reviewed that for the Corey Haim series and since filming that, which I think was about six, seven months ago. I actually got another Time to Live. And uh, the comment was, are you cold? I went, yeah, there's no heating in this room. It's freezing and it's, it's Baltic outside. And I've just came in here, I said, right, postman's been in. I'm like, oh, freezing cold. So should I have a heating in here? Possibly, but it's absolutely freezing. Now to make sense of this, we need to go back to last week. Yeah, so yeah. It's actually just wrapped in an envelope. I didn't realize that. Oh, <laughs> well, this isn't what I ordered, this isn't mine, and this definitely isn't the Backlot Murders, that's what it's meant to be, it's meant to be the Backlot Murders. So yeah, last week I uh, was going for it, wasn't I, I was really going for asking it, there's going to be a gap here, it's even filtered in other videos, and yeah, I ended up with the unseen. Now I haven't even opened this till now because I'll tell you why in a second. This is the unseen. No idea. Absolutely no idea. Oh, there's a bit of a spider thing, haunting thing. So that could be a, a one for the weird, wacky, but wonderful. When I had no idea what I'm gonna watch and see how that one goes. So basically, I opened that thinking it was going to be the Backlot Murders. And it wasn't, was it? <laughs> now, I got on the eBay, the guy, the seller, obviously it comes from Germany, or no, sorry, Holland, and he was like, oh dear, <laughs> don't worry, keep that, I'll send you the other one. I was like, all right, so that's how that's happened. Now, I just had a knock at the door, and I got this, which has been inspected, because it's actually open. And then I got another knock at the door, and another parcel, but that's a different video but it will have something to do with this. So yeah, I have two packages the last week to my house, so this one's been inspected. It's got a uh, past signed by the Royal Mail, or what's in here. I mean, it kind of kind of looks like it could possibly be drugs, but there we go, it's not. So yeah, basically the back lot made is wrapped in cling film, a lot of it, and below that, okay. Now I can't fault the seller at all. You know, it was a mistake. Especially if he's collecting VHSs and then you know he just picked the wrong one up. But when I looked at the messages, he had he actually sent you pictures of the tape. He sent you pictures of the tape actually playing, um, and I didn't see their messages because I'm not signed into um, eBay. And Brit missed them, so when he came, it was like, all right. Now here we go, the backlot murders. I finally have it again. Um, obviously, Corey Haim, Charles Fletcher, Patricia Burns. A random wood picture on the back now. The Batlock Murders is genius. As I say, it's just got the Batlock Murders on there. Nothing inside it. No. It's gonna attack us. So yeah. I always thought that looked quite a bit like Alicia Silverstone on the front cover. Now the Batlock Murders is absolutely genius. It's actually been reissued in America and actually got this from the actual director, this one. Um, obviously they completely changed the front cover. Um, basically shot the film on the back of Universal Studios, utilised Jaws in the background, used, utilised the Cycle House on the hill, you name it. There's a bit where they're shooting a music video on the set of The Lost World, Jurassic Park, on the steps and stuff like that. So they utilised the entire back lot, which is really cool because in theory it's got probably a couple of scenes of the burbs because if you go to Universal, the back lot to... The Lost World is right next to the Burbs Town. It's right next to Whoville. So yeah, it's kind of like cool and Corey Haim pops up in here. It's a very short little kind of role, but it's never been available here in the UK. The Blu-ray is great on there and Corey Haim has been added to the back of the box. He's kind of like the Anne character in it. But back in the day, um, I had it on small box. Now this is my second collection of this. I was it's a mass compared to that. There was a couple of things survived, but between moving out my parents to moving in my own and my parents not realising I wanted to keep this valuable shit, <laughs> I just left it there for safe haven. It disappeared. And I had the Backlot Murders on American import. And that's how I watched and how I had it. Now, I did think this was a big box, but it's not. 
so it's kind of like the European ones have been trying to get a lot more of these so you know blown away um, roller boys just roller boys I've got one from Japan I think that's the only one I've got from Japan um, silver bullet from Germany um, as I said last resort recently from Australia or New Zealand one of the two um, I think it came from New Zealand actually and that's it so I've got a few small box ones and obviously backlot murders needs to be on there now I can't for the love of hell there we go again there's snowboard academy right that's from Europe somewhere I forgot I even bought that um, and we'll go along here demolition high demolition you the double O kid I forgot I bought that <laughs> I don't look at these shelves enough because the double O kid I put that in the wrong place I recently used the Double O Kid uh, I did an interview about VHS shops and I had the Double O Kid in my hand. But yeah, that's, that's, that, that's, that's all correct. And obviously Fast Getaway was the other video I did for the unboxing um, and that's a time code one. Obviously Fast Getaway from, I love these uh, VPS videos because we're all the boys and Fast Getaway like that. So I've been collecting these import ones. And it's really cool because again the stuff comes out there but i did think it was going to be big box but it's not but again check it out um it's got audio commentary on the blu-ray but i have decided which one i want to take off i'm going to take that roller boys off and i'll tell you why in a reason and then backlot murders can now live there so at least backlot murders is represented and it stands on its own and then there's two next to each other so you know it could it could be cool to keep all the two Corys together then you've got Corey Feldman ones up here I mean these shells are still pretty solid like but um, you know it's gonna it, again they pop up really cheap so I've took Roller Boys off because I've actually had this one for ages and it, it, I would have done a video about this on the channel this looks photocopy but it's not but then I'm sure it is because it's just the way it's all crumbled um, it's the way him looks on there but, but let me look at it man it's, it's, it's crumbling a bit look at that now I'm going to have to hoover but the cover look at that the cover is rotten um, but obviously that one is in lovely condition and you know for the first time ever you know I've got two roll boys which that is just trashed and I've also got two time to live and obviously the time to live these two can now <laughs> creating a backup set I think they're the only I mean I'm saying that uh, there's two fast getaways one's a time code though um, anything on there are alternative versions so the fast getaways time codes uh, obviously counterparts to uh, New Zealand and stuff um, so there's no two up there of anything you know what I mean so yeah anyway so this is the first of two videos I need to film as I say the Backlot Murders, massive shout out to um, the eBay seller who I obviously don't have my phone in some says. Um, and just say a massive thank you because couldn't ask for that, you know. Sent the wrong tape, I've now got two tapes and if down, with, down the channel somewhere I might go, right, let's make a video about the unseen. Because I have no idea what it's about. It's all in on there, I don't know if it's going to play in English. And it looks really bad. See the outtakes. I wouldn't want an extra shelf. <laughs> Still in the outtakes. See, the other parcel I've got on parcel, right? Doesn't you go on the shelf? It's got. It's actually can go somewhere very clever, and it's another one. To be honest with you, it's a, an American one. I won't tell you that much. I might make you watch the other video to see what it is. And uh, I would have had both of them at the same time. And again, back in the day, um, tracking this stuff down. I mean, is an outtake because I ain't got much here. Let's just look at these VHSs. And the DVDs are there, and the laser discs are here. If you're a Corey Haim fan, just Corey Haim. What the Corey Haim, Corey Feldman, right? Batman and Robin, yes, it's widely available on Blu-ray. Murphy's Romance, pfft. it's been on DVD in Australia. Never Too Late, First Independent. Um, obviously, First Independent just disappeared. Um, the only films I know First Independent that survived are Mortal Kombat 1 and Dumb and Dumber. Anyway... Never Too Late, I mean, you could watch these on Amazon, right? But Never Too Late is on DVD in America. Snowboard Academy, only in America. Fever Lake, um, been on DVD in the UK, so that's one of the rare ones. It's one of the shitted ones as well. 
Uh, Demolition High, Demolition U, Demolition University came out in the UK, but the second the, the second one, but the first one never did. You not get them, and um, I think I've got Demolition High from uh, China, and I've got Demolition U from um, Australia, and that's the one notoriously known for having him on the front cover for a picture on a license to drive. It's like. So the distribution of all these are all over the place, but again, just one of the girls, a double O kid, license to drive, battle up murders, pray they're all the boys, and then watches at the end. I'm not gonna bother the rest of the tips because this outtakes has gone a bit wry, but like some of these you can only see on VHS. Fast getaway one and two, only on VHS, Dream Machine, only on VHS. Without Malice is on DVD. Um Silver Bullets out there, Oh What a Night was out in Australia. A time to kill, a time to a time to live, uh, only on VHS. Shooter on the side. That's the only thing ever of that. Um, I mean, Feldman stuff's quite there. Illegal entry, no surrender. You know, man, it's it's crazy when it comes to movies and collecting stuff, and you know, um, but it's passion and product. You know what I mean? So yeah, rant over. Hangover kicking in. See you in the next video. Goodbye for now.